day, all I'm Rob Cairns, the CEO and Chief Creator of Amazing Ideas at StunningDigitalMarketing.com. I hope everybody's having a good day. Today, I want to talk about social media. Lately, I've been making some changes in how I have been using social media. I thought I'd share some of these ways with you, and hopefully some of them can help you in your business. The first social media site I really used was Twitter. I have always had a soft spot for Twitter in my toolbox. Twitter is where I've made many friends and first increased my social media following. I have many friends and business colleagues thanks to Twitter. The second site I really like is LinkedIn. It's great for connecting with like-minded people in the, in the business world. One of the things I like most is you can see what people have done in their business. This helps you decide if you want to connect with someone or not. On LinkedIn, I like to connect with people in my industry and more people not in my industry. More on this in a separate podcast. I still like to produce how-tos and post them on my YouTube channel. Sometimes I even go live to YouTube or Facebook as well. I use an incredible application as web-based called StreamYard. Check it out today. Instagram. This is a social media service I've posted fun pictures on from time to time. I have to admit, I've not been a, a big Instagram user for the last while. That will start changing over the next couple of weeks. I'm going to ramp up on my business Instagram presence over time. Now on the Facebook. Let's talk about Facebook. This is a social media service that everybody loves to hate. It's also the biggest one in the world by numbers of users and active users. It is a service where everybody still goes and it is the king of the social media world. Facebook has its issues. The biggest is its so-called lack of privacy settings and people constantly complaining about Facebook's lack of privacy. We need to go there. People need to read the TOS, Terms of Service. People also need to think about what they post on Facebook more or any other social media service. Privacy always starts with you. Please remember that. Facebook for me is a must. I work in the social media space and advertise for ourselves and clients in the social media space. Now, one of the biggest issues many people have is they join Facebook groups of people in the same industry as them. This can be good or bad. Let me explain. If you're spending time in groups that are geared towards your industry, you can share and bounce ideas off colleagues. That is not a bad thing but not the only thing you should be doing. You also need to go spend time where your customers and potential customers are. This is very important as well. This is how to network and go after new businesses and keep your existing customers happy. This matters. I think you need to be in touch with where your customers, potential customers are hanging out, what they are doing, how they're doing it, and why. Then try and solve their issues problems and concerns. If you solve enough concerns of others and give them what they want, you will get what you want. The second thing is on social media regardless to the network, Facebook, Twitter, LinkedIn, and, and more. Take the time to thank all new followers and connections. This does not mean sending them a hard sale, but thank them for connecting with you. Be pleasant and appreciative. This means saying thank you. Kindness goes a long way. I have also limited the amount of time during the day that I spend on social media. I usually check it in the morning, midday, or later on in the day. That is it. If you're not careful, social media can be one of the biggest wastes of time, and time sucks, and this can hinder your business. Would you not be better off working on things than make your business money instead of throwing something away that you cannot get back, and that thing is called time. Do not get me wrong, social media is good in many ways. I love social media as much as anything, but we need to be careful on how we use it and when we use it. This is something for each one of you to think about. Use social media to make connections that are meaningful for your personal life and your business life. These connections often translate into amazing connections offline. This is the amazing power of social media. 
Thanks for joining me today and listening. Use the power of social media to aid in your endeavors. I wish you good luck, and if you need any help, please feel free to drop me a line at VIP at stunningdigitalmarketing.com. Have a great day, and I love you all. Bye for now. Thank you for listening to the SDM Business Marketing WordPress Podcast. The show is hosted by Robert Cairns, the CEO and Chief Creator of Amazing Ideas at StunningDigitalMarketing.com. This podcast comes out every week. It's available on all podcast platforms. If you'd like to be a guest on this podcast, please email us at podcast at StunningDigitalMarketing.com. If you'd like to find out more about the digital marketing services we provide, please go to StunningDigitalMarketing.com. This podcast is dedicated to Robert's late father, Bruce Cairns. Have an amazing week. Keep your feet on the ground and keep reaching for the stars. Make your business succeed.